In this short tutorial, I'm going to talk about how you can easily check your CPU usage overall as well as per core usage. So you don't need to install any utilities for this. All you need to do is head over to the task manager. For this, you can either press Ctrl or Delete or you can right click on the taskbar below and select task manager from the menu that comes up. With the task manager open, head over to the performance tab. and the performance tab, look for the box labeled as CPU on the left hand side. Now this shows you important details regarding your CPU including its usage. The current CPU usage is shown under the utilization section. You can see that my current utilization is 13, 10, around 12%. This can also be seen in the small indicator that appears on the CPU box in the menu right here. Now by default, this window shows you the overall utilization of the CPU. So this percentage here is the overall utilization of the CPU. To check how each individual thread is being utilized, right click anywhere in the CPU section and in the menu that appears, select logical processors from change graph to. Now you can see how each thread is being utilized. Point to note here is that while I have a total of 8 cores, the reason I have 16 logical processors or 16 threads is because I have a CPU that has multi-threading enabled. This is a feature that is often available in mid to high end CPUs. Hence if you have an older i3 or i5 CPU or if you have an entry level CPU like a Celeron or Pentium CPU, then the number of logical processors or threads will equal the number of cores you have. If you are confused by the number of cores or threads you have, it is best to check the official technical details of your CPU. In any case, my CPU currently is almost at idle state and hence not being utilized enough. If I were to run a heavy application like a game, this would certainly spike. Ideally, CPU usage in any application should not reach 100% or should not come close to it. If it does, then that means it is being bottlenecked, resulting in performance issues in your apps or games. For instance, 100% utilization of CPU while playing a game could result in stutters and lags. Now, while there are many causes of high CPU usage, one of the easiest ways to fix it is to head over to the Processes tab and look for the apps that are eating up the CPU. You can see how much CPU a particular app is using by looking at the CPU column. I currently do not have any app that is utilizing a significant chunk of my CPU. However, in some cases, certain background apps can cause a spike in CPU usage, which you can address by simply right clicking the particular task and pressing end task. Be careful when ending the tasks using this method because certain apps are actually crucial to the operating system and can cause unwanted issues such as crashes. So I hope this short tutorial helped you out. If it did, I would appreciate a like and a subscribe.